Yes, at the general election, they come up very soon. As a matter of fact, next year will be 2023. And um, you get one particular thing where they linger in the mouth of um, virtually every political parties. When I mean political parties, political parties where they lead for the matter. And this matter gets to do with the issue of um, zoning. Any party where you go right now, zoning, then they carry on for head. It just blasts now, even the defining factor right now. It just blasts now, what did they talk about, even as we did so? And what will be this zoning, what would they talk about? Zoning gets to do with um, every region one day represented, every region one taste that office of the president, every region one taste that office uh, uh, of, um, seat of the governor, every region one taste everything, especially if the region feels, say, look, then they marginalize them. And if you come from Nigeria, we get six, uh, six geopolitical zones. And if you also come look at them, these six political zones get their population, then get their people. And they also they crave for waiting. They also they crave, crave for um, representation, especially when it comes to that number one seat, which of course is the office, um, the seat of the president. This no matter what they look, and no matter what, well, as, as a matter of fact, what people see, what people see, even if you go for public, people see, they talk about them. Um, they talk, so, okay, who this party will bring out? Who the other party will bring out? Chain at this region will bring out this person. I mean, at the other region will bring out who will eventually carry the flag of um, each party. So on today's um, edition of um, Ask Ide Hot, I will they look the issue we got to do with um, zoning. Say this one, that's what, say it address injustice or inequality. And I will get a special guest as well who will join us very soon, very, very soon. I will go join us, um, that is um, after we we'll actually do the normal introduction and talk about one or two things. You go join us for the program to also look into this matter. My name is Vati Chen, my name remains Unkubi, and this is Ask Ide Hot. So as the matter be right now, eh, because of say today now Friday, we not go just say make we jump into today's topic. What we go do? Make we also come remind now of the topics and then the discussion we will get over the week. Make now remember say on Monday we come here on Monday, and we come also at least and discuss matter we concern you and me. Matter we say we affect our country, and then the matter we talk about on Monday get to do with which kind of leader. Nigeria really need. And we can't carry one Obunga guest come that day. And the Obunga guest, now, Ma, this time, Wabunwa, will be presidential aspirant under the fly, fly, fly platform of um, the PDP. He can come here, come talk in mind, come talk the kind of um, leadership we Nigeria actually need at this point. As he talk in mind, finish, who say, come to OK, uh, we can't wish away, say, if God, if willing, God say, now he go become the president. Anyhow, um, uh, to God be the glory. And from Monday, we'll come carry the matter. Enter when? Come enter Wednesday. And on Wednesday, what we'll come talk about? We'll look the Electoral Act 2022. Because if we also, we also look at, you no, know, say the Electoral Act don't become something we say, it don't linger for long. And we'll come carry one special barrister, one political analyst, advance Ufeli, call to, to the matter. If so, we'll come look at, so, okay, based on um, a lot of activities, Say he gets some things that they don't change for that electoral act. Maybe say he, he at least he will favor the election. And can also carry the matter. Can also talk about uh, uh, the CBN governor, where they drag between office and the interest to become president. So we can the law, look the law in between. Because they say this law grants them the permission to say okay, uh, if you be president while you are in office as the CBN governor. All these things, no matter where we will look about, we will actually look into. Um, on Monday and Wednesday. And as the matter be right now, I will not go so further waste time. We will just go straight um, to today's matter. Make we invite our guests as well. Make we also come sink our seat on top of today's issue. But as it be right now, make we quickly run, enter this break. When we come back, we don't waste time. We we'll enter the matter straight up as it be hard. They have planted the government some people down here. They will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. After they have planted the government some people down here. They will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. For politics, one of the common words with the always come to play, na gentleman agreement. This na agreement with two or more people from the same political party they get to make sure say they agree on some of the things will go happen within the party. One of these agreements 
na the zoning agreement. That one means say the way some political parties don't agree say with the way Nigeria they set up for different geopolitical zones, it be like say he go they bring candidate for election one after the other for the post of presidency. This agreement. Now to make sure, say, one zone for the country, no go just the rule forever and turn the presidency seat to their papa or which they call bed right. This process of zoning supposed to be good thing. So everybody fit take their turn and bring fairness when it come to the presidency. Over time, we don't see, say, some people don't they are grieved with the zoning citing say the thing no the work and everybody get the right to contest for election whenever they choose also some don't talk say this gentleman agreement on zoning na good thing but when it reach their turn it can't be like say people they change their tone yes we know say nigeria they diverse with different people from different ethnicity and zones but she the process of zoning now the way to go when it comes to selecting who go run for the affairs of the country or make we base them off experience and capacity, some of the agitation for the East now say them don't they marginalize for too long and them never get somebody to represent them for the biggest seat for the land. Well, do not get the crowd to fit command some election numbers. She had time for the presidency to zone to other region to make sure say everybody follow feel say them involved for the conversation to move the country forward and them no go feel left behind. Well, this is our discussion today for the show. And our correct and Ogbonge guest go join us to choke mouth on this one. And even you with the watchers, you go follow choke mouth. Yes, I will come back from that particular report. Now, don't take my own eyes. Yeah. Also, don't take my own ear. Listen to everything where our correspondent also talk about, um, you know, zoning, the issue of zoning. And they must don't also come analyze them. Uh, without even taking any further step, uh, we'll get our Bonga guest. Um, this particular person we will introduce. No, be, no be not. In fact, they call him family. Not like um, uncle. Not like daddy in between. And when it comes to the political um, um, ground, I mean, he's sabi. When I mean it's Sabi, it's Sabi well, 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 well. So we go also check out together to talk about this issue of um, zoning. And those people also can share, make we get your own experience pertaining the matter. And our special guest we'll get today, um, now got Gola Oba, now political analyst. And then, um, of course, a lot of Nago also know him. Oga Gola Oba, welcome to us, be hot. Thank you, Uncle B. Yes. Oga don't be my name now, I'll be in a title. No, now me choose to put Oga for your make name. I know whether I never I go do chief dancing ceremony. <laughs> you know, if they give you chief dancing ceremony, you're supposed to kill him mm -hmm. or kill a cow. I, mean, I understand, but for me, because also I get respect, at least I will put that small respect. I, got, I will God, put that respect God, for God will continue to bless you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Respect no go come out your matter. Amen. No, no go claim him. So, welcome to us, the host, once Thank again. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, you don't see the report we present. I don't also see my, at least, uh, you don't see here the introduction I also bring in. We get to do with them um, zoning. And I'm um, looking at this matter, no, this, the issue of zoning, no, today it starts. Over time, people don't they talk about it, don't they even heavily they analyze and say, no, it has to be done this way. It has to go around. If no, go and take them around. It just be like, say, some people, did they cheat them. So, Ogagwalova, waiting. From your own, what be zoning in this case? In the case of the background that way you where you play mm. and your introduction, in this particular one, we did talk about the two major political parties in Nigeria, APC and PDP allowing, say, make their presidential candidates. They come from particular area of the country. They, they, the PDP will get them for, for their constitution. Okay. Then do and so they say, if the North produce president, after the North, it will be the turn of the South. Now, 
some of us self no say that one. He encourage one particular injustice. We go reach that one when you start the question me. Okay. Because that one, he defeat the purpose. Where then take say, if the North use them, make a pass ball to the South, mm -hmm. because the thing where they want avoid by putting that provision in their constitution, which APC no get for their own constitution, but which they say then go they use by convention. Mm -hmm. Because for for inside constitution or for political any political setup, there are a number of ways where things they take get done. Okay. One is make that thing expressly they inside their constitution, mm. or make it be convention. Now, APC say they adopt them as convention, just like it did inside the constitution. Of, but the, conve the, cons the provision for PDP constitution and the convention where APC say they would respect, now because they won't take arm. Um, Soften the ugly face of majoritarianism. Mm. Our people were there at home. Mm. We need to define majoritarianism to them. And all countries in the world, and all democracies in the world, all liberal democracies in the world, how then they take soften the face of majoritarianism? Okay. Majoritarianism means, say, Nkubi, you and me, we be human beings. Mm -hmm. We did this studio. Okay. But our size, our body mass, they different. Obviously. Now, because our body mass, they different. Mm. We can't say you be human being. You know be, you know be dog. Even if elephant they here. Mm. I like tell you for no be human being. No. Hmm. We go respect them and give to them like an animal, but when human being they with human being, mm -hmm. I must not always have my way because Nami strong pass or because Nami they put money on the table between husband and wife mm. or because Na, na me be man of the house. That is why we say, Lord, go say, okay, upon all those advantages where you bring into the relationship, you must not abuse her. Mm. Mm -hmm. Now, majoritarianism is say one segment or one section of the country, they have get numbers. But that numbers must not be used because of the respectable democracy mm. where we want where we want culturalize where we want make our practice mm -hmm. to always have its way now not the only Nigeria they do amo okay the state of california if to say it be independent country it be two times the economy of russia when people they talk about russia they the economy of 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 state of California, mm. one of the fifty states of America, if it be one country where they, they stand alone, it be two times the economy of Russia. It would have been the fifth largest economy on the face of the earth. Russia, an eleventh largest economy on the face of the earth. My brother, but the state of California has a big reach for popul for human population and and size of of economy GDP. Now, the same number of senators, the state of California, and the state of Maine, mm. Maine, they sent, Give, um, they, they sent to U.S. Senate. Mm. You know what they take and do? That you will not crush the little one under the power of your numbers. Mm. So there will be a chamber where all states, we have to Nigeria, Nigeria, borrow our own, this is where we say Lagos mm -hmm. in size 
will be like, you know, say if you go between Calabar to Obudu. I know, if I. six hours. If I know. I know that one. I don't go out before. My brother, mm. look at the size of like Ogun State, Cross River State, mm. uh, and look at the size of Lagos in terms of geographical mass. Mm -hmm. And Lagos, they sent two senators to. You know what? 774 local government areas in Nigeria. If you look at the population of Lagos in numbers, Lagos by population, human beings, should have about twice the size of the local government areas where they can Jigawa combined. Based on population. Based yes. on human population. Yes. But then use the size of land to give Kano and Jigawa twice the official number of local government areas mm. where Lagos get. Mm. Now, every, every federation and every liberal democracy, they always find ways not to use numbers alone mm. to create room, to create room for terror. That now why Nigeria even get one law mm -hmm. where it say, for this company, if this company be federal agency, mm. you must try to employ people in accordance with the divergence of the six geopolitical zones mm -hmm. and the 36 states. Okay, uh, uh, it, 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 bro, I'm going by what you don't talk now. Um, I mean, you don't give us an insight to what it be. Even come, even um, carry and go California, where America, as a matter of fact, where we, we even they copy the democracy from. Okay, but looking at them, um, so far, so good. In our over 20 years of this recent democracy with the practice. How we go take, which level, we, how we go take and um, put the position of them zoning so far? So we go talk, say, is they effective? Will they practice them in accordance with which we don't agree? Are be well, somewhere along the line, uh, you know? Number one, when you they talk of zoning, You go get the formula wrong. You know, say mathematics, mm. now subject of formula. Yes, yes. If you get formula wrong, you will likely get the answer wrong. Mm. If you won't talk of zoning, you go get the formula wrong if you start from 1999. Mm. Now, the history of Nigeria before 1999. Now he make people sit down for 1998 and say this party where we want form, People's Democratic Party, the party that codifies zoning in its constitution. Now the issue of Nigeria before 1999, especially, especially between 1993, where they still Moshu Dabiola election uh, presidency mm. and 1999. Now I made them sit down, say, you know what? If we don't want this country to disintegrate, mm. we, because we don't see picture, say this country will disintegrate. If the area where it is in their majority, they uh, they ro run rough short over the area where no get majority. Make we put them inside our constitution. Now, to ask me questions say, from 1999, I go sit down here, I go, they look, you say, so you think, say, in 1999, this matter start. This matter start, mm. or how you go talk about one particular region of this country? One particular region where we say, since 1960, mm. when Nigeria get flag and anthem independence, even if you are not totally day free, mm. and on a leadership, they always be follow follow leadership. But since we get flag and anthem independence, one particular region of the country, now only six months, but they, they take, they take, get executive leadership of mm. Nigeria. Since 1960, six months, six months, 
And that six months, now by accident of circumstance, because that person be the titular head of the Nigerian army, when some young army boys, mm. when they do coup, and the coup they are about him, now the person can't wear the title. Comes me carrying for head, yes. He can't wear the title. Mm. And in six months, as a result of this now, we are going the day balance to. Okay. As a result of the deceit of Southern leaders from 1953, when we start, when Oyibo people, before they give us full independence in 1960, when they give us the right to self government, from 1953, before 1953, all the leaders of Nigeria, the three major leaders mm. of the three major regions of Nigeria. Two of them agree saying our federation will go be. Two, one campaign against federation. Namde Azikwe no one federation. And you know why Namde Azikwe no one federation? Okay. And now they punish uh, the East now. Because from 1930, the Indigo nation came to the conclusion, say, the way Wales Southwest take get get education advantage, they must catch up with the with the Southwest. From 1930 to 1950, the East, every community in the East, if you know if you start school, then go send somebody to go to school. Mm. Even if your parents don't get money, in so much as you sabi book, then go contribute money, send you to go to school. So then by 1950. The first university, even for the southwest of Nigeria, the first university of Nigeria, where the southwest of Nigeria, where the southwest, where get people, where East don't so produce well educated people enough that now the first, the first vice chancellor, DK, the indigenous vice chancellor, mm. now southeastern. By that time, the East, because of the advantage of education, and the power where they know, say, you, you don't, you, you they watch that program uh, where uh, they, that cut lag, they interpret for Yibo. Yeah, for Ichoku. Ichoku. Yes. I because know. they know the importance of the person where they work with Oyibo. Mm. You know what the, the Southeast did? Majority of the officers of the Nigerian Armed Services, especially the Army, they were from the Southeast. Okay, okay. Majority of federal civil servants were from, from the, the Southeast. Southeast. So when the coup, Happened in 19, in 19, December, 19, December of 1965. And so January 15 of 1966, uh, mm. when that coup happened, happened, now majority of those who were killed were, were Northern officers. Yes. You understand? Mm. Now, by the... By the July coup. That after, yes, after six months, they're about. The remaining Northern officers will control the, will control the foot soldiery of the army. You know what they do? They retaliated in a manner where we say the majority of officer Keda will be Southeast, then kill them. Bad. And sad. But you know another one? Mm. I said the East now. Let me come to the Southwest. Okay. Awolawo. Now he be the most prolific writer, as Oyibo people could call it. The person who write the most on federalism. Abi? Okay. Awolawo barely became, barely became the premier of Southwestern self government in 1953 because AG get majority but no get controlling majority so he took the alliance of ag and Ibadan people's party and edo edo union party to form government i barely i will all barely became a premier mm. you know what between 1953 and 1959 i will become a phenomenon in governance so by 1959 i will who had written copiously on federalism mm. 
If he recontests for Ibadan for 1959, it would be it would have been a landslide. You know what Inawola will do? Person where they preach federalism, traitorously, out of his own ambition, left the position of executive power in Ibadan and came to become to become a, a hollow leader of opposition for center. Now you must remember that Sadano we follow our law to agree. Mm. Say federalism na him na him better part. Na him better part. Mm. When Sadano had the opportunity to become the leader of federal federal government, my brother. Wait, okay. When Sadano had the opportunity to become the leader of federal government, he no go center. He no go center. Mm. He sent the second in command. So, you know the thing where ultimately happen? The thing where ultimately happen, be say, as a result of the overwiseness of the Southern leaders, mm. you excited, you excited the sense of paranoia of the North. You know, be say, they justify this. Mm. So, from 1966, July, you must remember too, that on May 24, 1966, a decree 34 was made. That decree, now Intel, the Northern people say, these Southerners, if you allow them to gain control, they will rubbish us and put us back. By then, they came to the mentality of using majoritarianism. Mm. But you know what? Even majoritarianism no favor them mm. because they must learn to be magnanimous in power, not in, only in victory. Mm. Naim be the foreground explanation we need to give the issue of oh, Okay, I got about. I mean, the way you don't carry the matter go now, you don't kind of to a point where we say people they want to say, eh, even give us history, join. And um, I know say uh, we'll go quickly enter market now. Once we enter this market, we'll go come back, we will continue the matter because where you don't talk and reach, you don't talk and up to the point where we say, even right from inception, the matter to ensure say we balance across ethnicity, across regions. Nobody today it starts. It don't stay where it starts. And I want even to come before back independence. From, yes, even before independence. But when we come back from this break, once we come back from, the, from this particular break, where they go, the matter will go still continue because we still get a lot to talk about. The men are not touching a die, will they come? The black state government will go down here. They will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. The yeah, black state government will go down here. They will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. The yeah, black state government will go down here. They will seal up their ear. Once they seal up their ear, they will go back to sleep. Yes, welcome back. And the program still remains as the hot. And um, I was our strongest today for us, Ogagoloba. And I was still look into this particular matter we get to do with zoning. And um, how far and how well zoning do actually um, play out for Nigeria. So, Gaboloba, before we go to that particular break, you don't, you'll be, tell us a lot of things we get to do with how this problem takes start and the fight and the battle for every region to make sure, say, them balance up and they for the same equal, um, you know, I would call it equal competition, equal rights with every other region. And, and these things, of course, cause the problem we caused that time. And they've also come look um, into the era of um, the military period where we say job like now one region, now he dominate power pass. Okay, they bringing it down to um, the democracy where we practice now, this current democracy. If we look at from 1999, at least we go talk, so we don't experience the leadership of um, Oga Obasanjo for eight years. We experienced the leadership of um, Yara Adua, the late Yara Adua. Also experienced the leadership of um, El Good Lord Jonathan. And currently, we experience the leadership of um, Oga um, De Buhari. If you look at these people I don't mention, you go to say they come from different, different regions. You understand? So the question I want to ask is, we go talk, say, um, uh, zoning at this point in time, because now still zoning with the, the whole matter still revolve around. Che, we go talk, say, if they in line, say, if they actually they go the way it's supposed to go. I mean, still if you say, you know, you see commerce is there inside. If we love ourselves, let me put it this way. You know, say when I do my background historical information for the benefit of our people with the watch for mm. us, you go see how fear and balanced where I try to be. Yes. But let me now say with authority to leaders of northern Nigeria, 
if they love themselves. If they love themselves. If Wari won't do the greatest good, he has wasted fantastic opportunity as a leader. Wari is an historical failure. His legacy, leg in fact, history will not be kind to him. But if he won't do himself any good, especially do Northern Nigeria the greatest good, if he's smart, he's supposed to let leadership go to Southeast Nigeria. But you know, get the balls to do it. I'm sorry to say, you know why I say he's supposed to let mm -hmm. go? Okay. This thing? Why? I said, they follow you talk now. Mm. The reality of Northern Nigeria, we say, it is a dis disintegrating region of this country. It's not peculiar to Northern Nigeria. Okay. If you look at the whole Sahel, from Burkina Faso to Mali, mm. if to say France no get a 5,000 army in the last five years, six years, in the Sahel, preserving the fakeness of nationhood, where they between Mali, Niger, Burkina Faso, all those places for no big country. And you know what? Because Northern leadership, both traditional and political, because they were so, so incompetent and failed their people, the madness where they desire, don't come to Northern Nigeria. And as I'm talking to you now, I know they, I need to, I know they gamble, but I can put my last bottom naira on this table. Say there's no bumpy everywhere. Make you go retire to Daura. They kidnap the head of Daura. You remember? Mm. For six months. Yes. Now money they take pay. I say there's no bomb, President Buari. Make you retire to Daura. You want me to put another bed? Okay. I, be, as a director in a company, I had to join people to close a branch in, in Kaduna about about three years ago, we, some of us don't see the thing where they happen. Say, go happen to Kaduna. Because by that time, we know if reached reach Kaduna by, by moto. By moto. So we go, go, we go fly, go Abuja. We go, go take train. train. One day, early in the morning, 6.30 a.m., I dare we do station for, for Abuja. I look at the caliber of human beings who sit for that all. And I told myself, you will be a foolish boy. Mushu taught some of us some things. Yeah. What we not learn from university? Yeah. I say if I be a terrorist today, or if I be one of these people where they profit from grandstanding, the Sunday Boos of this world, the Asari Dokubas of this world, if I be one of those, because Nigeria don't they reward grandstanding. Mm. May some people billionaires for just grandstanding against the nation. I looked at the caliber of people in that this thing. I saw about three strategic officers of state where I know for Abuja, they won't catch the decision. I said this thing, they will eventually, I tell myself, I said this thing, they will eventually, and if you come Kaduna serve, if you come down for Kaduna for the Gaza, the place where you go take, take from train station to city, now you go put train station, don't blame the don't, don't blame the Chinese. So mm. now the methodology where the Chinese take build their country with that, they will put two major train stations in a city to the two ends of the city, so that development could come from the ends, come make development in the center. If you notice, say uh, except for Lagos, where they put for a mm. in a, in Abia Okuta, they put at uh, Kobakwe area. That's a uh, Oluko, uh, 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 Mama Fela name, the okay, one with the uh, some Kuti, and the one with the name after Professor mm -hmm. this, for uh, Professor uh, Walishinka for Ibadan, they put one for uh, Akitola, and now, but in in the case of Nigeria, look at Abeokuta, Ibadan, and Kaduna, where did they put those, those train stations? We no get security infrastructure. We go protect the lives of people there to come down. When I finish that one, I go back. I say I no go take training anymore. I can't take I can't take plane. The next one where I go. Mm -hmm. When I took plane from the airport, where then they drive me? My my 
your ma that is your heart, they were here. Uh, okay, you... Make we quickly remind them our viewers say our telephone lines they open right now. And um, if not see from our screen, I will see say I will get two solid numbers there when I will feel call. And the first one is 080 8940 And the second one is 080 8930 So call either of this line. Make we also make not check mark for this because this matter. And um, this matter is concerned now. Now, also, if you go our Twitter handle as well, everything they uh, from our screen there, make now tweets to us, make we also get on our views about that. So, 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 in view of this background where I don't paint, mm. apart from number one man in Nigeria, mm. the next most important northern and number three man, they no born the senior president, make go spend one week for, for the village where they born now, for Yobi. If you feel bad, Make a bet with me, one way bet. If I, they don't burn him, make you go sleep for one week for in Mama Town for Yobi. In fact, you know what? The, the chief of army staff, mm. you remember, say a former chief of defense staff, they not only attempt, he had to fly his family out of his village, mm. eventually he was killed like a chicken. Mm. Chief, okay. chief of defense staff. Okay, Former okay. chief of defense yeah. staff. Yeah, okay, we got Samuel. I bet just chief. We got Samuel. Samuel, all the way from Ogun State. Good evening, Samuel. Welcome to the Hot. Samuel. Good evening, no. Yeah, ah, we greet hi, you. Yeah, we we'll greet you, Samuel. Yes. Continue. So I, I get questions, sir. Okay. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Now my question is, say, what do you think about um, the Train station, sir. The train stations are good. You see, it's, it's, uh, hello. Uh. The train stations are good. Like I said, in the last forty years, the Chinese have told us that some of the things that they do follow follow after mm. the West after, mm. then go do on their own way and give result where they shock even the people in the West. Historically, for more than two hundred years, trains would always come to the center of of any city. Mm -hmm. And development will spread, we implode. Developments will implode from the center to the outskirts. Mm. But the Chinese in the last 40 years, the thing where they do with train, they say, then go put one station for one outskirt of town, another station for another outskirt of town, because they know, say, train, they always move people and goods and services. Across, yeah. So from those two ends, Development go come. The only danger for Nigeria, especially in northern Nigeria, you say northern Nigeria is disintegrating. Okay, uh, based on that, uh, maybe we'll collect another call. Um, we'll get uh, somebody there at telephone line once again. Simon, I say you still there. Okay, um, uh, okay, make, make I so you'd go need more resources mm. to police those this. Now he come back where I make me say I know they bet, but I feel bet with Baba Buhari say no feel retire for Kaduna safe. Hmm. He must. He's an Abu man for life. Oh, okay. Uh, okay go Even go the go. wife don't they live for Dubai. Okay, go over. I, I get one very important way you talk. You, you, you talk say um, if uh, he did very good for the president, say make in carry the office. Uh, I say no get balls. He I, no get the balls. But we don't also get, get something some kind information. Say he get your own interest. He get passed away in. You understand? But if we also go look at based on this same level, based on this same matter, and how if we take also ensure, see, if now zoning want to they take they define the unity of this country, if now zoning want to they talk, ensure, say, at least uh, everybody they duly carried along when it comes to development, when it comes to leadership, how it is say we go fit effectively put this zoning into place where we say everybody will feel happy for their respective regions. You see, Zoning, na child of necessity. If to say Namdi Azikwe, at least he was open from the constitutional conferences. Mm. And a wall of war, if to say then they honorable, mm. the two of them, we for no day this school day sacred with him. If to say a wall of war did what Sadauna did, when he had the opportunity to come and rule the whole of Nigeria, as the prime minister, where he say he no day interested because as a federalist, he go stay in region, developing region. 
He to say that for 1959, Chief of Bafa Miawolo, who had by then become a phenomenon in, the in, in administration, not only in Southwest, in the whole of Africa. Because the thing where you go take no say, Awolo, don't become phenomenon in the whole of, in the whole of Africa. You say, in 1963, when Awolo was convicted, I read an article in the, the Economics magazine. Mm. Oga Golo Babek, just hold on. Somebody, uh, Abdul Kadri. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, quickly talk to us. They hear you. Huh? Abdul Kadri, contribute to the hear you. I make sure say you bring the volume of the TV down. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, yes, yes. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, Chief, good evening. Good evening, Abdul Kadri. Okay, okay. The volume is down. The volume is down. Good evening, Chief. Good evening. Continue, continue. Hello? Good. See, I beg, um, yeah, Abdul Kadri, if you want to call us, we'll make you just bring down the volume of our TV. Miriam. Uncle, good evening. Good evening, Miriam. I greet you. Okay, Bola, okay, good evening. Good evening, uh, Thank Maria. you very much for always enlightening us, especially with history. Thank you. But my question now is, I beg, this one where a message is a contest, where would they keep our electoral material? Are we sure our electoral material will be safe with him? Because you know they keep both with him for the same place. Number two, I want to talk about the railway. The free railway they did from Niger to Nigeria, while other parts of the country is suffering from bad roads. The deed has been done about uh, Sadona and uh, what have they. What is the way forward? Because if three of us are working, Two people have been left left load of uh, left uh, off their load of the if they, they have removed their load on their shoulders, the person that is still carrying load will not be happy, even if the person is going jolly good with the others. That person within the person's mind is not happy. I think this running is the perfect thing to do to correct the wrong that is going on. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Miriam. I'm um, about. I don't know whether you go. You go respond to this question later after you done probably. Have you already responded? The right thing now? where Madame talk last, mm. now here they explain say mm. zoning, zoning. We need to zone, but not only zone. We need to micro zone to the southeast now mm. because I tell you, say since 1960, executive power to lead this country has only stayed for six months in one particular area. Mm. And when you ask me question about 1999, mm. I tell you, say, now 1999, the K-Leg begin. Mm. OK, no. Your OK, uh, OK. The first one where Madame talk, I don't understand. No, she talk about railway. Uh, um, mm. We mentioned, that one, no, you say. But uh, on the fact, because of, say, we know to get time, um, but, uh, your general assessment, eh? she, I mean, for, on the final note, Sure, you even think, say, make we even look at If they look at about competence, they look about, um, you call it shade zoning, they important. Forget yeah. competence. Forget competence. The same argument within the use of competence, now here yeah, they use for even women in leadership. Mm. Nigeria, since 1960, now moonwalk with a dance. You know mm. moonwalk now? Moonwalk now, we get this. Michael Jackson. Yeah. Michael Jackson won't work. We mm, say, go nah, back. back, they go. Mm. All these men, <laughs> all these men, we're ruling now. Then, then give them a progress. Mm. That's now why me believe, say, we must get legislation. Like they have in Germany. Germany, less than two, year, two or three years ago, made a law that for the board of any blue chip company, 30% of the board of any blue chip company must be women. The countries on the face of the earth, where they get, where they always register the highest quality of life indexes are the countries of Scandinavia, mm. Norway, Sweden, Finland. you know, Finland. Most of their leaders are women, and they have legislation backed with a legislation bad system mm. where it protect not only women in the workplace, allow for women where they work to take their children to work, get crash facility for the children, and you see how those countries have 
are sustainably prosperous. Mm -hmm. So when I sit here and somebody they follow me, they follow me talk competence, I go say which competence? The competence of these failures will take us back to okay. 1960. Uh, because if we actually allow it, make we give you room, make it a talk. I don't say this talk, we know we're valid if you finish. But because of say it be one of our own, I know say um another day you go still definitely come because throughout the end of that period, they will say activities go plenty. And thank you very much uh, once again, Oga Goloba, for at least um, for, for honoring this particular um, um, invite who will invite you. I will go come back once again uh, on uh, Monday, and that's uh, so the other up this Friday. We'll come back on Monday with another beautiful edition um, of As the Hot. I believe by then, my brother, um, Ezugu Chukudi, go also don't be here with us. So from my humble self... You don't go shop for Abuja. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us, let me bring something to you. <laughs> for now, bye-bye.